Unveiling a new strategic, a new strategic uh, campaign, it is uh, to spur insurance appreciation and uh, there's leaving and then there's leaving free aimed at boosting uh, financial literacy and empowering individuals uh, to uh, secure their financial futures. And uh, this evening I'm chanced to be joined uh, by Mr. Kuma Samit uh, Gurav, who is the Chief Executive Officer uh, there. And thank you so much for joining us uh, this evening. And uh, uh, can you briefly explain yeah. uh, to our viewers Viewers, those watching and indeed clients and those who are trying to sign up uh, um, where this campaign is coming from and also talk to us about some penetration there. Yeah, thank you very much. Um, well, I'll just brief you about the background of this campaign and about Jubilee Insurance as such. So 87 years ago, uh, Jubilee Insurance was founded in Nairobi with the sole mission of safeguarding the pillars of our customers' lives and to make their life simpler and to help them in all aspects of life, like you know, financial planning and all that. So I am therefore delighted to make an announcement for our thematic campaign, there's a living and there's a living free. This campaign is all about optimism and freedom. When we talk about optimism, that is, we believe that there are two aspects of life and it depends upon how you look at it, yeah? It depends upon how you look at it. One aspect is living and another aspect is living free. So for example, I'll just quote an example to make it more simpler. You have a life which you are living, but if you have a partner which is taking care of all your worries and these worries can come up, you know, from your financial planning worries or children's education or, uh, you know, health related uncertainties. If you have a partner you can count on, think of the situation, you'll have a life which we can call it as living free. It's not living, it's living free. So that's all the campaign is all about. It talks about optimism and freedom. Freedom from all your worries that can worry you, you know, for, for the time that you're there in, in, you know, in this world. How is this campaign likely to enhance um, uh, um, health security across the region from uh, the way you're planning? Well, uh, that's a good question. Uh, you know, it is in public domain that as far as insurance penetration in Uganda is concerned, the penetration is less than 1%. So there lies an opportunity. Unfortunately, in this part of the world, insurance is still being perceived as a, a luxury and not a necessity or a tool to risk management. So, you know, we are taking all efforts from our side to ensure that we are able to increase penetration by educating the customer. You know, you educate the customer and make their life simpler by making them realize and understand the complexities of insurance. You know, insurance per se, you know, you'll see that insurance is famous in their fine, for their fine prints and all that. But if you make the customer realize and understand the benefit that insurance can bring across all the worries that he may have during his life, it can make his life very simpler. And that's what our endeavor is. And definitely, it will increase the penetration because it's all about educating the customer. Once the customer is educated, he will definitely have a live free, you know, status for the rest of his life. Yeah. Um, many Ugandans um, are yet to buy into this whole idea of insurance, even when you, you scare them. They, they, they drag their feet, if you may. How are your clients expected to benefit from this? You know, that's a very good question. I must tell you, you know, two things in life are inevitable. And, but people don't accept it. One is death and another is taxes. You can't evade it, right? So where I'm coming from is, of course, what you're saying is right. People have a different perception when it comes to life insurance or health insurance. But, you know, given the uncertainties of life that we, we come across, we, and life keep throwing challenges, I think it is all about educating ourselves and looking at life in a very serious manner. For example, I'll just quote one example. During the COVID time, we used to receive numerous queries on insurance. So people were scared. You know, people started thinking that if I don't secure myself, I'll have a tough situation and my family will be stranded. We had numerous queries coming from the customer. Now after vaccination drive, that query has gone down because okay. people started gaining confidence about their life. So it is all about perception and this campaign there is a living and there's a living free. We intend to challenge that thought. We intend to make people and citizens of Uganda and entire East Africa 
make them aware about the necessity of life and life insurance and health insurance is all about necessity it is not a luxury okay mr kuma summit uh, gurav uh, shukriya as uh, my grandfather used to say it's certainly been a pleasure uh, talking to you and we are live at nine does take a very brief break